I'm Daniel Madison. These are the brand new remedies. These are the Madison Schneider Casino Remedies. This new addition to the Remedies family. Schneider and I wanted to do something very different for 2022 and this is what we came up with. A deck of playing cards that would look perfect and beautiful in the Madison Schneider Casino. I'd like to let the color, the design, pretty much everything about this deck speak for itself. But there are two things in this deck that I'm particularly excited about and I uh, want to share with you right now. The first one is a very simple block color playing card. This is a cutting card. The second one looks like a very innocent poker guide showing you the poker hands of playing cards. These two playing cards are gaff playing cards. The secrets, the deceptive secrets that these two playing cards are responsible for. I'm going to share everything with you on my YouTube channel very soon. The Remedies logo represents creative freedom. The feather initially stood for Madison and Charlie. The rose for Schneider, black roses. But when we brought them together, we discovered something beautiful. This symbol that stood for creative freedom. The feather represents flight freedom. It's also a quill for creativity. The rose represents romantic beauty and the poetry of storytelling, which is what we as magicians do every time we use a deck of playing cards. And the most important thing about this logo is that we didn't want it to be just our logo. We wanted it to be a symbol for creative freedom. This is your symbol. This is for you. This is for anybody who uses the playing cards or for anybody who stands for the same principles and is in search of, through their magic, through their artistry, creative freedom. Stay close to my YouTube channel. I'm going to be sharing every single secret that is hidden in this deck. And I can't wait to teach the poker lesson and show you a few things with this beautifully deceptive device. I am Daniel Madison and these are Madison Schneider Casino. Remedies.